The GOT contains a battery. This battery is used to store clock data and data in internal memory. Batteries eventually die, and so their status must be checked on a regular basis. I will now describe the procedure to check the battery status. First, open the utility screen. Touch Time. If GOT internal battery voltage status is normal, then the battery is still good. Once a low voltage state is detected for the battery, data will still be available for 14 days, but the data may be lost at any time afterwards. Replace the battery as soon as possible once a low voltage state is detected. I will now describe the procedure to replace the battery for the GT2708 model. First, make sure the power to the GOT is turned off. In the GT2708 model, the battery is inserted under the SD card cover at the rear of the GOT. Refer to the manual for your device as locations can vary for each model. Open the SD card cover. Remove the old battery and disconnect the connector. Insert the connector of the new battery into the GOT connector. Insert the battery into the GOT battery holder and then close the SD card cover by pressing the cover until it clicks into place. Turn on the power to the GOT. Open the utility screen and confirm that the battery status is now normal. This completes the procedure to replace the battery. The device can be configured to trigger a system alarm when the battery voltage is low. Refer to the included documentation and product manual for more information on this configuration procedure. Although GOT devices can send notifications and perform analysis when failures and errors occur in system equipment, when the GOT itself fails, it could lead to serious consequences in losing the ability to detect any system equipment errors. Keep the touch panel clean to ensure responsiveness. Do not use sharp objects or strong force to operate the panel to prevent damaging the glass. Although the GOT2000 series was used in this training, the older GOT900 and 1000 series models have similar functionality. Refer to their respective manuals for more information on using these devices.